One of the most annoying things about these masks is unlocking your phone while you're wearing one. You either have to take the mask off or enter in that passcode, especially frustrating if you're in a store trying to answer a text or look at a shopping list. But a new update for iPhones is going to make this a lot easier. Apple's new iOS 14.5 has another option. If you have an Apple Watch, you'll be prompted to set up Unlock with Apple Watch in Settings. Once you do, your phone pings your Apple Watch when you raise it. Your Apple Watch needs to be on your wrist and it has to be unlocked, but once it's set up, checking your phone while wearing a mask is super helpful. Hey Siri, play music from Jackson Brown. When asking for music, Siri is always played from Apple Music or your library. That's fine unless you use Spotify or another streaming service. After downloading iOS 14.5, Siri will ask for your preferred streaming service and then play from there. Apple Maps gets a big update, making it more like Waze. Now drivers can notify others about heavy traffic and speed traps. There are new emoji. Apple says it's 217, but most are just options of different skin tones. There is a new flaming heart, and the blood spurt from the syringe emoji has been removed, making it more appealing and versatile to be used for the vaccine. So when can you get iOS 14.5? It was actually supposed to be released by now, but Apple continues doing beta testing just to make sure everything is working correctly. We do expect it to be released to the public sometime in the next few weeks. That's What the Tech. I'm Jamie Tucker.